up? This is Kendall with True Natural Bodybuilder. Um, I've been playing, this is my first year playing college football. Um, I've played two years of junior college baseball as well before this. Um, today I'm going to show you a few lifts that we like to do and what we do a ton during the season um, to keep kids fresh but also keep their legs in strength. As everybody knows, football, you need legs. I mean, upper body is somewhat important, but legs are the main thing that are going to help you in the sport of football. So what I'm going to do today is how we would do this. We'd go four sets of six or eight, um, usually around 70% or less of what your max is on front squat. Um, we'll go a little lighter today just to show you guys. And then we like to superset these with straight leg deadlifts, um, which I'll show you after. So. I'll just get right into it. A lot of people, when they're doing front squats, they like the, the grip here and they go up. Um, I prefer using these wrist straps and coming here, keeping my elbows up because every time I do this grip, it seems to mess with my elbow a little bit. Um, our coach won't allow us to do this grip. Um, he says kids still get the tendency to lean forward, which you want to avoid when you're front squatting. So I use the wrist straps. Good, get a good tight grip on them. Bring them here inside your chest. Make sure elbows are up high. Walk it out. Make sure you look down, square yourself up, and you're going down. Up, coach really emphasizes 90 degrees or lower on these. Make sure you're getting your depth. Getting down there, keeping the elbows up, head up, sinking the butt. Make sure all of your weight is on your heels at this point. And after that, we'll come over to the straight leg deadlifts, pick up a weight. We sometimes do them with barbells with weight like this, or even dumbbells work in each hand. Um, grab it here, start with one leg, head and chest up and down. Usually about six to eight a leg, alternate. Focus on balancing yourself. You feel it in your hammies a lot. Um, really good workout to keep the legs in shape, but also stay fresh during the season. So that's it. This is Kendall with True Natural Bodybuilder. See you out there. I think one thing that athletes need to remember um, when they're after workouts, whatever, in season, off season, um, when it comes to nutrition is throwing everything back into their body that they've lost, whether it's calories or anything like that. Um, so that's where protein um, after your workout is essential. Um, there's a lot of good proteins out there that are strictly, you know, post, post workout proteins. They're going to throw the calories back in there and they're also going to give you the good protein that you need to help your, bo your body recover and your muscles, you know, rebuild. Favorite supplement, um, as far as a specific brand, I mean, I've tried countless proteins, pre-workouts and everything. Um, I, there's, there's several products that I like. I like the, um, the muscle milk um, has been, you know, it's, it's pretty generic. You see it all over. It's not a big time name, but for me, it worked really well. And that's what I found out was finding what works, for, works best for your body and I've, I've used their gainer and their muscle milk. And then I also like um, pre-workouts. They seem to help me get that edge at my workout. When I get there, I'm ready to go. I'm not just kind of lackadaisical. So um, my favorite pre-workout right now and for the last little while has been C4 by Cellucor. Um, it's, it's been a go-to for me. I don't, know, I don't know why I've tried, like I said, countless other supplements and the C4 seemed to be my go-to. Um, there's, there's several things athletes can do to, you know, help their recovery time. Um, I think protein is huge. Um, your body needs those proteins to recover and rebuild. Another thing that we do, um, on the football team is ice bath. We do a lot of ice baths. Um, you know, you can really flush your system and that takes a ton of the soreness away. So usually, you know, we'll lift hard all week and then where our games are on Saturdays on um, usually like Thursday. Uh, like you know either today or a Thursday 
we'll um we'll, we'll ice bath hard you know a good 15 20 minute ice bath and it'll make your legs feel awesome on game day